Layla. Mm -hmm. Why don't you ever speak up? What? I just noticed you're really quiet around people. Is that a problem? <laughs> no, no, no. Well, maybe. Maybe. It could be seen as a problem. You know, I, I don't really think this is any of your business. Layla. Lucas. Can you drop it? Please. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. It's just, you talk so quietly that no one ever hears you. Your ideas, your opinions, they never get heard and people just talk right over you. Well then maybe people should try listening better. Well you could help them out a little, you know. You don't talk that quietly with me. You are different. How am I different? I thought we were dropping this. There, you can raise your voice in me, but why can't you do that with other people? You want me to yell at people? I want you to make them see you. Why does this bother you? So much. Because it bothers you. And you pretend like it doesn't, but it does. How would you know, hmm? Can you see inside my head? Do you know what I'm feeling? Of course not, but I know how I feel when I'm not being listened to. But to live your life like that every day, you must be screaming on the inside. Why not let it out? Where did all of this come from? Do you remember when Emily asked if anybody wanted something from Buster's? That's what this is about. <laughs> Buster's. Hamburgers. <laughs> you started answering, but no one could hear you. So Brennan spoke up and told her what he wanted. And by the time that she got back around to you and asked if you wanted anything, you looked so defeated and just shook your head no. And I moved on. <laughs> I'm fine. Stuff like that happens all the time. I'm used to it. But you shouldn't be. Why not? Because I know you. You have so much to say, Layla. Don't get used to keeping it all in. You deserve to be heard. It's not that big of a deal. You are way more upset about this than I am. Stop lying to me. Lying? What makes you think I'm lying? Because I'm your closest friend, and maybe even your only friend. I can see it happen all the time, and I can tell that it affects you. You don't know anything. Oh, well, if I don't know anything, Layla, then tell me. Tell me how you feel. I'm fine. You're lying. I, I'm not. You are. You are frustrating me. Oh! And that's something. Layla, tell me more. How do you feel when people ignore you? How would anyone feel? That's not a real answer. This is ridiculous. And yet you're still standing here. I feel like you want to tell me, but you've never had the opportunity to tell someone the truth about how you felt. But now you do. Because I'm here. And I'm listening. I guess I'm just scared. Of talking to people? No. Not exactly. Uh, it's silly. I'm sure it's not. I just get so anxious. I never know how people are going to react to the things I say. <laughs> Will they like the things I like? Will I say something rude? Insult someone? Sometimes I stay awake at night for hours, planning out one simple conversation in my head. And then I still mess it up. I, I get nervous. I, I, st <laughs> I stumble over my words. I say less than I meant to say, and I look dumb. Layla. So why say anything at all? Why not just avoid situations that will make me look stupid? Layla, listen to me. I have never thought you look stupid. I told you. 
You're different. How? I don't know. You... You just are. You always have been. I don't have to be nervous around you. You're just Lucas. <laughs> just Lucas, huh? You know what I mean. <laughs> no, I don't. I already told you how I feel. What else do you want? I want you to see what I see. I want you to see how amazing you are. And I can't understand how someone so amazing and perfect like you can say such negative thoughts about yourself. Layla, you don't look dumb. And you've never looked dumb. Says you. <laughs> right. Might be because I'm biased. Because I'm your best friend? <laughs> no. Because I like you, Layla. And I always have. Lucas, I... <laughs> Layla, I like you so much. So much that I think it's a little more than like. Maybe even a lot more. But I'm telling you this now because I want you to understand that your words are important to someone. And that you are important to someone. I don't... I don't know what to say. <laughs> Stop thinking so hard. You know how you feel. And it doesn't matter how you respond. Would it make me the happiest guy in the world if you were to say that you liked me too? Well, God, yes, but... If that's not how you feel, then it'll be okay. Don't worry about making me happy. I want you to make yourself happy. But, but I... I want to make you happy. You are so frustrating. You make me want to pull my hair out sometimes. You push me and you push me, but... I'm glad that you do. You have... No idea. I've never told anyone what I just told you about my anxiety. I keep it bottled up all the time, but you, you break me. You make me see that I'm worth more than all of that. That I don't have to be afraid, at least not when I'm with you. And maybe you can help me, show me what it means to be loud. <laughs> You are the loudest person I know, and I love it. <laughs> I love... I love you. Let me make you happy, like you make me happy. I think that's the most you've ever said at once. <laughs> Isn't that what you wanted? <laughs> yeah.